Hey guys, for today's video, I'm going to be doing a video on my fall hair care routine. And this is going to be like anywhere from shampoos to conditioners to leave-in conditioners to treatments to dry shampoos. And I'm also going to share some hair tips and get into the video with you guys. So first of all, I'm going to talk shampoo. I don't really use any other shampoo besides um, Garnier Fruities Color Shield for the fine shampoo. And this is for up to eight weeks of color vibrance. And it keeps your hair healthy and strong. It's got active fruit protein. Um, it's got Asia Berry and UV filters to help restore hair's power to keep color looking and feeling fresher for longer helps resist wash out fade out dry out so fresh vibrant color lasts longer that's what this shampoo does i really do like it and i don't really use any other shampoos just because i do tend to color my hair every month to every two months so i prefer Having a shampoo that does not dry your this does not dry your hair out at all, and it does not leave your hair greasy and oily, and I really do like this. And for conditioners, that was my only one for shampoos. And for conditioners, I'm gonna start with color shampoo. I mean not color shampoo, color conditioner as well. And this is the same one, just to like the shampoo version of it. It's just a Garnet Color Shield for the fine conditioner. Just the same thing. Um, I really do like this one because it's vegan formula. It does not have any harsh chemicals in it from what I can tell. It's supposed to do the same thing as the shampoo except you use it as a conditioner, so I just use it from like here down and then I'll leave it in for like two minutes and then rinse it out. It makes your hair really soft and healthy and I just like how it makes my hair feel overall and again, it does not make your hair greasy. And for those that, those that aren't looking for a um, color conditioner or shampoo, I have a few in front of me. So one is the L'Oreal. Dream Length Conditioner. This is for one, one hair goes through a lot. It gets damaged, split ends up here, and it needs to be cut. So this is just going to help. Um, it's supposed to intensely repair your hair. So it's for long damaged hair, and it's supposed to help like split ends and stuff. So it's going to stop you from getting your hair cut at the salon if you don't want to cut your hair. It's got castor oil in it. It's got keratin in it as well. I'm trying to see what else it has. It's also got volumes in it and it makes the hair stronger it says. So I've used this a couple times and I like it. And then for another L'Oreal one, I also like to use the L'Oreal Extraordinary Oils Conditioner for normal to very dry hair. They also have one for very dry to coarse hair, but my hair is not like super super thick coarse it's just medium coarse but this is nice because it has like six different oils in it and it's meant to keep your hair soft and smooth and it's supposed to keep your hair healthy but without weighing it down what else does it say it has six precious oils transforms and nourishes dry hair so it's really going to be like a moisturizing conditioner, but instead it gets into the hair cuticles and really like make sure that it's conditioned and soft and healthy and moisturized. And I also use an other moisture conditioner in the winter time. I don't have it with me right now. It's in a black and blue bottle. It's the L'Oreal Paris. It's the Power Moisture conditioner and that's really good because it does pretty much the same thing but it's not as intense as this one and it's like lightweight so it'll make your hair ultra soft without leaving it way down or greasy and most of L'Oreal's um most of L'Oreal's conditioners or hair care products are designed 
to not weigh down your hair or make your hair greasy, which I really like. And now for like a miracle treatment, this is the L'Oreal Total Repair 5 Instant Replenishing Hair for Damaged Hair. It's a rinse out conditioner, so you only leave it in for like a minute and then you rinse it out after that and it'll leave your hair so soft. I've used this a lot of times and it's supposed to strengthen your hair. It helps with density, vitality shine and silkiness and you don't really need a lot of this because it goes a long way so if you do want to apply it depending on how long your hair is you may only want to go like shoulder or down and nothing above that because if you go like above your shoulders it might make your hair greasier so just focus it on the wind i mean on the ends and this is also good for brittle weak flat rough and dull hair but and it smells nice. It smells kind of smells like fruit, but it's not really fruity. It just has like a fresh scent to it. But I like this. And now I'm gonna move on to dry shampoo. I only have one dry shampoo I use, which is Dove Dove Refresh and Care. This is the invigorating sham dry shampoo. I've talked about this a lot of times. Um you can use it in between the days that you don't wash your hair and it really does get in there and like absorbs the oils on your scalp that you know are going to make your hair greasy and it does not weigh your hair down. It does not leave like residue behind but it just makes sure that your hair is like fresh and just like how you would normally wash your hair in the shower, but the canned version. So I like this and I don't think I'll be changing dry shampoos because I really do like this one. Okay, now we're going to talk about leave-in conditioners, like spray versions. This is the Garnet Fruities Flat Iron Perfector. This is supposed to be a leave-in conditioner and a heat protector so i like to use this sometimes because it has argan oil on it it's got moroccan oil it's supposed to help protect your hair against the heat tame frizz smoothness and shine um it's supposed to help your hair sleek or it's supposed to help your hair stay sleek for up to 48 hours it is a little bit of a heavy leave-in conditioner, so you don't really need a lot of this, but it is really good for like dry hair like me, so I really like to use this when I get the chance. Um, and the last one is the L'Oreal Extraordinary Oil. It's a penetrating oil. Um... It's for silky softness and shine. It's non-greasy. Penetrating oil absorbs into hair for softer and shinier looking hair with no greasy finish. It's for all hair types. It won't weigh your hair down. It's supposed to nourish your hair with silky softness, smoothness, and shine. So I normally use like three pumps of this when I get out of the shower and just run it throughout my hair. Not so much on the top but the ends and then I pretty much use this every day just because I do have frizzy hair but when I do use this on like second day hair I only use two pumps and then put it throughout the ends and then I'll brush it out. And it does not leave the hair greasy, it does not weigh your hair down, it does not make your hair feel gross or disgusting or anything like that. And I recommend this for anyone that is struggling with dry, greasy, I mean not dry, greasy, um, dry, frizzy hair. And now I'm going to talk about one final product, which I've talked about before, which is my wet brush. I've done a video on this i tested this out in a video recently about um using the wet brush for 
for wet hair, I really like this because it is not like yank out your hair, it does not hard on your hair, it does not hurt your hair, but it does like tangle knots and tangles without pulling hair out. So if you want to see me testing that, this out, go watch my video on that and you'll get more of an idea of it. So that's it for my hair care routine. I hope you guys all enjoyed. If you want to see more videos like this or updated hair care routines like every couple months or every few months, let me know in the comments down below so I know. Or just let me know on social media because that's where I take video requests. And yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Give this video a big thumbs up. If you liked it, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.